Here's a video to show how you can share different links and tabs during your Google Meet meeting. So first of all, I am I have my meeting in session right now. I'm the one on the bottom right and the guest of my meeting is this one that's in the middle of the screen. And so now what I'm going to do is click the share or present now. Okay, so if I click present now, it's going to give me three different options, Chrome tab, window, and entire screen. Ideally, it would have been nice if we could use the entire screen, of course, being careful what all is open, but that way you would be able to have a document open and then if you open up different links or tabs, everything would show, but we can't do that. What happens when we do that during Google Meet, I'll show you, is if you click this and select share, you get a message that says infinity mirror and it says to avoid an infinity mirror, don't share your entire screen or browser, just share a tab. And if you do the entire screen and just ignore its warning, this is what it looks like. So it's infinity it's just like a bunch so it just obviously it just doesn't work so here's a way around it i'm going to click stop sharing i'll click present now again and let's try this again so you're going to want to select the first option chrome tab and select the document that you want to start with and the one maybe that has like all the links on it click that select share and now you're going to see the document that you want to share open and then your guests are going to be on the right hand side. So when I am clicking on this document, it's like in annotation mode and I don't want that. I want to be able to like scroll through it. I just clicked on this little like lightning bolt icon, select stop annotating and then on the top you see where it says view tab that's what you're going to want to click on so when you click view tab you'll still see you and your guests on the right hand side and then you see this like little preview that's what the guest is seeing right now and now i could go to this document and scroll through it and they see exactly what i'm scrolling through if i have a link on here that i need them to see I'm going to go find the link and I click the link and it opens. Now I see it on my computer, but it, as you could see on the right hand side, it's still showing the person that's in the meeting, the other document. What you have to do to get them to see this new page is select share this tab instead. If I click that now over on the right hand side, you see that now they're able to see this new website that I'm showing them. When I want to go back to that original document, I have to go to my tab up here, click it, and it's not going to show them that, ta that new document that I switched over to until I select, again, share this tab instead. So whatever document you want them to see in your meeting, you have to go up here and select this little button next to the sharing button. So let me do it one more time. Let's select this one. Okay, this document. The document shows on my side, but the person in my meeting is still viewing the other tab. I'm going to go up here and select share this tab instead. And now the person in the meeting is seeing the current doc. So this is how you can share different links and different tabs during your Google Meet meeting. And I know it's a little more complex and complicated that I hope this helps.